today we'll be learning how to set up wow. reaction roles for your Discord server using the car bot. First thing you want to do is create a Discord server. Here's the one I made for this channel. Go to server settings, then roles, then create roles you want to give out to members. Here's four of them that I've made, but let's go ahead and create one with you guys. Click on create role. Under role name, change it to whatever you want. Today I'm going with the colors theme. So next color will be blue, so I'll use blue. Now click on the blue color and click save changes. Now you wanna click on the link in my description and it will take you to Carlbot's website. Click on invite to Discord server, in my case manage because I've already used this bot before, and choose the server you want to add Carlbot to. After that, click continue, scroll down and click authorize and verify that you're a human. Now you can go back to your Discord server. Now over here you can see that I've already made a channel for the reaction roles. You guys can also do this so members can easily find where to get your roles. Now when you come back to your server, you want to go ahead and type question mark reaction role make and click enter. Now you want to type in the channel you want this message to be in. In my case, I'll go ahead and put reaction roles and click enter. So over here, let's go ahead and put the title, choose your colors and put the symbol in and let's go ahead and type roles. After that, you can choose to put a color next to your message. It's basically this thing, this blue line over here. And you can click on this link and choose a color. So after you click on it, you can choose a color and it will give you the hex code. Let's go ahead and make it red. Hashtag FF0000. Go back to your Discord server and paste it in. And as you can see, it has made a red line. Next, we're going to be adding the emojis and the role name. So let's go ahead over here and click on the red heart and we're going to be pinging the red roll and click enter. And if you've done it correctly, Carlbot should put a white check mark. And now you can add as many roles you want to put in. Now as you can see, Carlbot has put a white check mark next to all my messages, which means all of them has worked correctly. So now that we're done adding all the roles and emojis, we can go ahead and type done. Now as you can see, we can go ahead and delete this, and we can clear all these messages. But over here, you can see that choose your colors, red, yellow, orange, green, blue, Carbo has created what we have just done. So by default, the reaction roles are set to normal. I'll go ahead and explain what that is later on. But as you can see, when I click on red, it gives me the red roll. And if I click on yellow and orange, it'll give me yellow and orange roll and green, blue, etc, etc. So once you're back on the Carbot dashboard, you wanna go ahead and click on skip. Now over here under utility, click on reaction roles. And as you can see, you can see the reaction roles message that we have just created. Now under type, you can see that it's set to normal. You can click on edit. And down here, you can see the message type and a small description of what it is. So by default, it hands out the roles and it does what you expect it to. But let's say you want a unique one. It only lets one role from the message to be picked up. Let's go ahead and undo all of these roles and go ahead and click save. Now that we're back on here, we can only take one role. As you can see, it's canceling all the other roles. So I can only pick orange. And every other message type is pretty self-explanatory as it says under the description. So yeah, make sure to smash the like button and click subscribe. And I'll see you guys in another video.